Hey cheese, what's up? Today I'm gonna be sharing with you guys a game that I've been kind of playing a lot lately. It's called Cavernous Kingdom. You basically just I don't know how to explain. You basically just uh get different ranks and then you just move up forwards until you become a guard. And yeah. So today I'm gonna be get, showing, like giving you guys a tour of oops of the kingdom. So before you get a job, you'll spawn out here. To get a job, you have to go to one of these desks. And these are the receptionists. I'm a receptionist. And you join the group and then you can go and they can yeah, anyway. First you gotta join the group, the Cavern's Kingdom um group. Oh my gosh. Then one you can go to one of these desks and um if you join the group, you would, over your name instead of receptionist, it would say, um, recruit, oh my gosh, I can't say it, recruit, um, I think that's how you pronounce it, I don't know, I don't, it's not one of the weird words I say a lot, but if you didn't join the group, it will say guest, and the receptionist will press the red button, and you cannot go to the next step. If you have joined the group, and this says recruit, it, they will press the green button, wait, let me show you from over here. And this down, and they go here. If you, um, after they press the green button, you will get teleported to the security room. I'll show you that, guys that later in the video. Not so because I'm not a security person, but I'll show you the outside door. Okay, so only, um, workers can go after this point. So, and this is only supervisors. Wait, we can come in here, but you can't. It's just for the supervisor. It's like their work spot. And this is, you can ask some questions, and yeah. And here is the AFK room. You just go in here to be AFK, so in case you're trying to you see people in here and you want to be friends with them and they don't say hi, they're probably AFK. But the good thing about in here is that you get extra points while you're AFK. So it's kind of good, just leave your phone or PC on while you're doing something else. And, um, you'll get your points. And here is baby Princess Alaska's room. She is, um, the princess, Cavra's daughter. And she's baby, and she's the princess. I don't really know what else to say about that, but yeah. And here, um, it's nothing in there, so I don't go in there, is the library, um, yeah, I don't want to say it has books, like an ordinary library. Um, and here you can go get your books, like for your basic guidance and receptionist book, if that's for you. Like whatever books, like handbooks that you need to know how to play the game. It'll help you, you can get them in there. You can also get them while you're doing training, but um, yeah. But after turning, you can go in there. Here is the water in case. Oh yeah, you also have to have your toilet and um, food thing stats up because if you don't, you could get arrested. Um, I know it's kind of weird, but and here they have a water station, so you can have your water and it'll refill your um like. <laughs> Your food stats over here is like the um game passes wall and donation area this i we can't go in here by the way if you go into um, a room that you shouldn't go in you um lose your health points thing and um if you lose enough of those then you die this is the private afk room you need a game pass for that I don't really see the point of getting it. I mean, it gives money for the game, but like, I don't see the point. So it's just the private AFK room. So you can be AFK without anybody else. This is the spawn room for after you get a job here. Um, it's pretty. This is an event room. It only happens sometimes, every once in a while. So, this is the thing, it shows you all of the 
ranks they can get up to. Let me see. Get some updates, pictures. It's kind of like it's kind of a useful tool. These in here are the bathrooms. Um, because like I said, you could get arrested, which I'll show you the jail later. If that gets down low, this is an exit. Um, there's really nothing for you outside. Yeah, just no room out there. This is the high rank room. You have to have a high rank to go in there. These are the stairs. Yeah, little. I'm trying to memorize where everything is. There are signs to help you though. That's really helpful. So these are the downstairs. We go into here. The bunkers for fire drills that happen on Sundays and Saturdays. The weekends you go in here. Red wires. Except I think it would be better to just go outside, but that's my opinion. This is a game pass room. You have to go have a game pass room there. This is the announcements room. Um they do like special ceremonies and do award sessions, which is when guards or other high ranks give extra points. Um yeah, oh no, I'm stuck. Okay, I thought I was stuck. Okay, I'm good. This this room is still in progress, so stay tuned for that. But this is the memory room. It's kind of cool. It just says, like, a history about the kingdom and stuff. The Ice Queen. Um, Bianca. The day show the bathroom. This is the bathroom on the basement. Um, I remember. I was looking at the, um, memory room. But yeah, now we're going up the stairs. Up to this floor. Um, here we have a throne room. Only the queen and special people can go in there, obviously. Here you have the eating area. Um, this is the drink shop thing. What the heck? Here you can order drinks, and over here you can order food. They can each, um, help you improve your food stats. Here you can peek inside the throne room. That's cool. Okay. So here's the security room. I can't go in the security, but you go in here, and then security will, like, after the receptionist sends you, because you join the group, and you can start training, you get sent to security, and security just double checks and sends you into the waiting room, which is where you wait for the trainer to start your training, and this is where that is. It's all the training rooms and the waiting room. This is where we came in through the stairs, but let's go back up to the next floor. Okay, so that's where we came in. These are stairs. I'll show you that in a minute, but over here, this is the rankers room, and I'm pretty sure that, yeah, rankers are the ones that can rank you up without getting extra points. You just, you just ask them, you don't beg, but yeah, they can rank you up to the next rank, or whatever, any rank they want. This is the advisor's room. They help you with any help. They advise the queen sometimes if they're lucky. And yeah. Just another room. This is the meeting room. Um, I think, yeah, definitely higher ranks can go in here and have meetings. Stuff like that. I don't know. It's pretty obvious, but. Over here, that's where it came from. But here. This is the quiet room. Um. It's kind of like the sleeping room for the employees. Um, it's just a nice little lounge thing that the queen look thoughtfully built for us. The part room work, I'm not allowed to go in there, but I never actually seen what's in there. This is where they do the music. They can control music. So as you can see, I put my volume up, but they can change the music. I don't know exactly who can do that, but someone can. I don't know what the Patron Room of Work does. I do, I'll have to check that out, but yeah. The part of theater, uh, theatrical stuff, the part of media. Honestly, these rooms aren't all used very much. They're just little extra rooms. Um, but... I'm not in this room. I don't know. These rooms aren't very used very much. This floor in general is not used very much not very popular i guess this is the community room we're not allowed to go in there i think it's just an excuse instead of saying higher rank room but yeah 
is where I came in the left door, but this is the right door and we're going up to the next floor. Okay. This is where we came in. This room is coming soon. And this is the Queen's private quarters. There really is not much up here. Oh, I can go in here. I cannot. Okay. What does it say? Private meeting room. This is like your bedroom and special rooms. Okay. Last floor. Okay, so this these are the towers up here. Um, and this middle building area is the jail in case you get arrested for like trolling or something like that, whatever reason. You go in here. I don't know where the door is. But yeah, that's basically the whole castle. Anyway, um I recommend playing this game, it's really fun. Um it's a really big community. And you can always rank up. And yeah, it's just a pretty fun game in general. And I recommend doing it. Oh yeah, one more thing. You can change your face on this thing. Um and these are emotes. Um you kneel. Wait no. You um oh my gosh. You bow to any other worker and you kneel to any higher rank. Also, you say yes, and then they're, yes, mine, then their rank. If they're a high rank. After you kneel. Anyway, thanks for watching this video, and yeah. We hope you guys try this game. And um, comment any other tips and tricks or things related to this game or not related to this game. Bye!